But Jesus said to him, Do not stop him, for the one who is not against you is for you. Luke 9, verse 50. The context of this verse is interesting. There was someone who was attempting to be used by God, more specifically to cast out a demon, and the disciples felt that this wasn't right because the person wasn't a true follower of Christ in their opinion like they were. Have you ever looked at someone being used by God to make a difference for the kingdom of God and wondered how in the world could God use that person to do such a thing? Maybe it's because the person has so many struggles in their life or their faith seems so weak or their comprehension of scripture seems so limited. So what does it take to be used by God to make a difference in someone else's life? One quality it takes is the willingness to make yourself available. Sometimes we get so overextended in our activities and responsibilities that if God does want to give us the chance to be used in someone's life, we have no bandwidth left to be able to do so. Let me invite you to pray the prayer that Ann Kemal Anderson used to pray. Lord, I'm available. Anne would start her day with that simple prayer and the opportunities to be of service to others and let her light shine was inspiring. Another quality it takes is genuine concern. St. Paul tells us in 1 Corinthians 13 that if I do all sorts of impressive things regarding the Christian faith, but love isn't part of the equation, it profits me nothing. Sometimes we can become so jaded by the sinfulness of the world that we have a hard time genuinely caring about the people around us. The only way that we can truly love the people God places in our lives is with the love that Christ has shown us. We can't manufacture love ourselves, but we can be a conduit of Christ's love to others. Another great prayer to start our day with is, Lord, help me to genuinely love and care about those that you place in my path this day. We may not be the most gifted or have the most biblical knowledge or make all the right choices, but God will use us to make a difference in the lives of others as we make ourselves available and ask Him to give us a love for others that only He can produce. And maybe we will be the one about whom others wonder, how can God use that person? May it be to his glory and honor. Press on in the Lord.